Okay, guys. So as I mentioned before, right, um, the most important structure or the most important shape that we're going to uh, need to draw for this chicken is uh, that big triangle that was right in the middle, right? That big triangle is going to um, pretty much help us figure out how big everything else is. I know before the way we'd measure proportion is we would uh, find something like the head, right? Or like one small shape and then uh, see how many times that would fit into uh, the larger shapes. But now I'm gonna be working backwards and using a larger shape and seeing um, how everything fits into that larger shape, all right? So first thing I'm gonna do is look at this triangle. Um, it's kind of like a scaling triangle where not all sides are equal. The longest side is going to be this uh, top side here, okay? And then from there, I have a longer um, left side, right? And it ends about here, okay? Like I said, it's a scaling triangle, so the sides should not be equal, okay? So I have my bottom left bottom edge or side, and then I'm just gonna connect these sides here, okay? So that's my main uh, triangle. Okay, that's my main structural triangle. Now, the way you can um, actually figure out uh, how everything else fits in this kind of situation is uh, you can create landmarks, okay? Something called landmarks. Basically, you're gonna measure where each other part in this, um, in this drawing starts uh, or ends, all right? And what I mean by that, let's look at the chicken, um, the chicken's head, right? This, this top triangle right here, right? We know this is gonna be a triangle. We just need to figure out where it starts. Okay, it's really, um, this chicken kind of makes it easy because uh, this triangle starts um, pretty much at the edge of, or sorry, at this corner of my um, larger triangle, right? So I know that that's a straight line upwards. And then um, it's about, it's about three fourths the height of this part of the, of the big triangle right here. Okay, so I know how tall it's gonna be, and that's a straight line, and I just have to uh, figure out how wide it's gonna be, right, after that, right? So in this larger triangle, it, it goes about halfway down um, the large triangle. All right, so I'm gonna actually make that landmark. I'm gonna mark on my paper that that is about where the head should go, right, or that top triangle should go. Um, actually, maybe even a little more this way, right? And I'm gonna erase the mark I don't need or the mark I accidentally made, okay? And that's my first landmark, right? That's gonna help me figure out where I need to put it. I kind of, I've kind of done this before where I've marked on the paper where um, my different things are gonna be, uh, but now it's gonna be more important um, because uh, it's gonna help me determine how big everything else is, okay? So now I need to see how big the um, chicken's uh, head, or sorry, how tall the chicken's head should be. I said about three fourths the height, so about there, right, that much. And I'm just gonna copy that measurement over. Like I said, this side, it's just a straight line. So I'm gonna put it right above there. And I know that, I'm um, oh, sorry, by creating this landmark, I can just draw a straight line down. Okay, and I don't really have to know how wide this is because um, it's a triangle, right? It's just gonna be a triangle. And there you go, right? That's about the size of um, the chicken's head, okay? Um, now I'm gonna move to the tail. Uh, there's a bit of a gap here. I'd say it's about a quarter, one, two, wait, maybe even a third, one, two, three. Yeah, so a third right, of this total length, okay, so the, the third, one, two, three, about, right, so it's about here, and I know this is going to be another triangle, right, it looks like a triangle, so this, this is a pretty much a straight line, and then it goes down, right, so straight up, and then, uh, let's see, the height is a little bit shorter, or kind of equal, but close, right, a little bit shorter, so I'm just going to match the height here, right? I know this is gonna be a straight line. 
and then this just has to connect upwards like so. Okay, so I have this major structural shape here and this major structural shape here. Uh, I have the bottom here, right? I have another, um, move this if I can. Nope, can't move that. I have another uh, triangle here. So I'm just gonna add that. Yeah, a lot of triangles for the structure of this object. And I kind of see like a triangle right here too. So I'm gonna add that. Like so. And then the straight lines for the legs. And then those triangles at the bottom. Okay. All right. And then the wing, this big triangle right here. It's kind of an isosceles triangle. So I'm going to draw an isosceles triangle. Goes to the edge here, right? And that's pretty much my uh, simple shapes, right? Oops, sorry, can't really see that. The sun's blocking it. But I have my triangle down here too. Okay. And once you're done with that, you're good to go for the simple structures of your chicken.